Hi guys, Wendy here. In this video, we're gonna draw my draw so cute pug. So let's get started. With this pug, we're gonna first start by drawing a big curve for the top of his head. So I'm gonna start right about right here and go all the way and just draw a nice big curve for the top of his head. So just a nice even curve like that. And then from there, we're going to start to draw the ear. So I'm going to come over here and I'm going to come about right here. I'm going to pop out one ear. So I'm going to come here, draw a curve that comes out and down for the floppy ears. And with this line right here, I'm going to continue it down and bring it in a little bit and connect it here at an angle for his ears like that. So it's going to do the same thing on the other side. So just make sure kind of about the same um, level for the ears. So one's not too long, too big, um, too short. So I'm going to come here, continue my curve about right there. And same thing, I'm going to go across, give myself a point. So I know that's where I'm going to start and curve out about right there. Doesn't have to be perfect, just want it about the same size. And we're gonna bring it in and connect it. So we got the little pug ears in. And then from there, let's come out a little bit right here and draw a curve to finish off his head. So we're gonna do the same thing on this side, so about right here, and finish off the head. And from there, I'm just gonna go ahead and connect it right here. We have a nice big curve. So this is basically going to be the top of, the, I mean his head, and where the collar that I'm gonna give him is gonna start. So just connect it. And then from there, let's, um, well let's finish his cute little face first before we go to his body. So I'm gonna start with the nose right here, the snout area, just to anchor everything. I'm gonna start right in the center, about right here, in the center, and I'm going to draw a curve. Nice little curve, and this is going to be his nose. And I'm going to draw his little pug nose. So I'm going to come in basically with a curve, and I'm going to go on the other side just to make it nice and even, and connect it with another curve at the bottom. I'm going to make that little part right there a little bit darker for his nostrils. And from there, since you know this is the center, I'm going to just bring a line down, a straight line down. And then from there, let's start to draw the snout area. So we're going to come from his nose and kind of imagine continuing this curve on the nose and bring it around about right there. And we're going to come back up to this line. So I'm going to kind of make it a little bit longer and connect it up. So let's do the same thing on the other side. So I'm going to come right here, just continue this nice curve, nice and round, and right there, continue my curve and go back up. So I've got this snout in right now. And then from there, you can come back right here at the bottom and draw a curve to finish it off. So right here, I'm just going to draw a nice curve to complete it. So then from there, let's come back in here in this triangle area right here and just add a little curve so that there's this little curve here at the bottom and it's not, I think that really adds a lot for the um, pug, the mouth area. And then come in here and just draw three little dots for where his little whiskers would be. And then you can come in here and just draw a tiny soft curve. And that's basically it for his snout. So then from there, we can start to draw his cute buggy uh, <laughs> pug eyes. So go about right here, in between the ear and the snout right here, I'm gonna draw a circle. Nice round eyes. So I'm gonna go to the other side, right there, towards my snout. towards the ear and draw another circle. And I'm gonna make them draw so cute eyes. So two small circles at an angle and a curved line at the bottom and shade in the top. 
So calling all pug lovers out there. Hopefully you guys love my drawing of a pug and thank you for all the requests. and lines at the bottom. From there, we're gonna anchor his eyes. So we're gonna to come to the side right here and I'm gonna draw a curve. And it's gonna slant down because pugs have that really sad look. <laughs> that cute little sad look. So I'm gonna come here and just draw a little curve down. And then right here, about right here, I'm gonna draw another curve. And it's gonna kinda of go this way because he has all these little folds. And so I thought that would add a lot to um, making it more pug-like. So there, isn't that cute? <laughs> okay, so from there, um, we're gonna draw his collar. So I'm gonna come in here and just come in a little bit. And on both sides, just come in and follow your top curve. So basically, we're just gonna be drawing the collar now. Oops. And connect it. And then from there, because my pug is loved, <laughs> I'm going to come in here in the center and draw a heart for this little pug. What should we name this pug? Let me know in the comments below what you would name him. <laughs> so right here, I'm going to draw a curve and another curve. And so these curves right here are trying to mimic those folds in the pug's skin. So I've got one big um, fold right here and I'm going to start to draw the back and I'm going to come up here with another fold and one more. So from here I'm going to start to draw his little back right here, come down and then from there I'm going to come in here and draw a curve. So now we're going to start to draw his body and let's see here. I'm going to come down here first. So I'm going to come about right, let's see there and I'm going to draw his one little foot. So obviously this is very cartoonish right here for the feet but I wanted to make it nice and simple for you guys to draw so hopefully I've accomplished that and then I'm going to come in here draw a little curve and then another foot. So it's basically just a soft point right there and then come over here let's finish off the back area come down so we're going to aim for the same level and then same thing, cut down and let's connect it. So with a nice chubby tummy. So we're going to go all the way over here. And then right here we're going to add another one. And let's finish it off with this cute little tail that curls up. <laughs> and comes back. And let's see here. Just finish it off and so there, cute little pug is all drawn. I hope you think he's really adorable and want to draw him and take him home. <laughs> Thanks so much for watching. And if you loved him, please give me a thumbs up and share it. And remember to subscribe so you won't miss any new Draw So Cute videos. See you later.